Sorry, still spreading the link. Alright, that's enough. Eh. I am <laughs> admittedly a little low energy. Probably not gonna go for all too long. Let's see, what, what did we do last? Hi Shepard, it's been a while. I'm glad to hear you made it off Earth and that Liara's with you. <laughs> Getting off her old ship was the best thing we could have done. Can't tell you how sick I was of that cabin. And of tripping over that drone. I don't even know how it kept finding me in a ship that big, even after I turned off its tracking. I dug up some interesting information for you. Talk with Glyph to sort out the data. I hope it helps, Shepard. It's getting rough out here. Oh, hi, Van. Commander, it was a pleasure seeing you again on Sir Cash, even if the circumstances were less than ideal. It seems that Van... that... that Van... It seems Van the dog has decided our meetings coincide with galactic threats. So be it. To that end, I wanted to reiterate that STG will be there to help when the need arises, regardless of the political climate. You were there for us in our hour of need. We look forward to returning the favor. Thank you. A friend do it. My friend James. Not feeling like VTubing today. So I, I, got, a, I got a picture. Ah. <sighs> Tessia, a Zari scientist, Rana Thanoptis, has died in custody, allegedly committing suicide after she was arrested for the murder of multiple Asari military officials. Prior to her death, investigators said Thanoptis spoke of voices in her head, which they believed to be indicative of her indoctrination. The voices foretold the ascension of the Asari and told Thanoptis that anyone fighting the Reapers needed to die. Thanoptis worked on a top-secret project for former Spectre Siren Asiri, Ar Arteria several years ago, where she likely became indoctrinated. She received a pardon from the Asari government in exchange for providing research assistance on Reaper technology. Thanoptis was believed to be responsible for, for planting a makeshift explosive device that detonated at, at a research center, killing five visiting Asari military officials along with four civilians. The attack seriously wounded a dozen more and caused significant damage to the facility. Investigators say they are not seeking any more suspects in the case. Damn, I fucking... I, I spared her and this is what I get. Oh, hello. How's it going? I'm a little bit under the weather, but I hope I can still provide a little bit of entertainment today. <clears throat> Probably gonna go for like an hour or two. Do like a, a mission or two I or three. I your bravery. You're now the savior of your entire race. The transmutative agent that propels a species to a new stage of evolution. Many will fear that. Mm -hmm. Ah, Commander, we were just... Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful. Or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. <sighs> is he? Yeah. What's that? A blood test. Mm. Mm. Commander, please explain to him my only goal is to ensure her health is stable. Sorry, I can't really blame him. <laughs> Considering everything the Solarians have done to the Krogan, can you blame him? Considering I'm probably ending my career in STG by helping Hell yeah. him. Yes. Why do it? Every species has their role. Sometimes you just gotta sit around. Centuries from now, the Krogan could be the pinnacle of galactic evolution. Even I don't believe that. But I want my people to. Then let him work, Rex. Just keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Of course. And remember, I still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. I just spent like, uh... Now if that's settled, <laughs> I have work to do before he changes his mind. I just spent several hours playing projects on Void so on your server. Rex about me. I had no 
choice. But you win against your own Almost forgot that it was stream time. <laughs> I couldn't watch your entire species go extinct while the solution was being held prisoner in my laboratory. Your people fear my kind. That will never change. It has to. Fear has never contributed anything to the galaxy except more fear. The cycle must be broken. Besides, you deserve better than being treated as an experiment. Uh, it's a whole bunch of mods. It's a, I'm, I'm on like a, a roleplay server. I actually played barely any vanilla because it's honestly not all that enticing when you're just on your own. Like I got, I, I tried several times and it just, it just couldn't keep me. And I never really got very far. And uh, then I found another streamer. And they have their own little, little, uh, big old, big old re roleplay server. And uh, I've already made friends with one of the neighbors. It's honestly pretty cool. I'm hoping to, like, meet more people soon. Uh, I found two radio frequencies, but I've not been able to reach anyone on them yet. Even though I did find a walkie-talkie, finally. Uh, I spent like the last week subsisting off cockroaches and now my crops are finally done so I can eat salad and uh, Yeah, that's that's the latest development. I've also figured out about foraging So I'm not likely to eat any more cockroaches ever again. I Was kind of stupid. I don't know. I, I never had to do that. That was never necessary I could have just gone out and picked some leeks and berries and whatnot <laughs> Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. i bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom comes from pain, and the Genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, <clears throat> a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan... Oh, hey, Aki. How's it going? How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. Oh, damn. How did you make it out alive? I started digging the wrong way. I was in complete darkness. Nothing other than my own heartbeat to sustain me. What happened? <gasps> I found this. A simple crystal, but it became my chisel. Take it as a reminder, Commander. In the darkest hour, there is always a way out. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. God, In yeah. Heart, Rex wants what's best for us, though not all the other clans see it that way. The dumb thing is, cockroaches like give you barely any nutrition, but they make you very, very unhappy. <laughs> but then, fortunately, I also had a bunch of alcohol, <laughs> so I could just, I, I, I lived a very wretched existence for that week, just cockroaches and bourbon. <laughs> Just barely making it through each day. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that you can tell him. Also, hell yeah. I love Albert the Somnian Files. Also, I, yeah, I was I was talking about uh, my my um, my time in Project Zomboid. If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the Genophage? I knew sisters who couldn't bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a Thresher Maw would kill them 
and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath, that's when my life truly began. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. There <clears> is nothing else. There is no reason to exist. Honestly, I should have streamed the next it. Day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. Like, I, I should probably, like, do Zomboid streaming sometime. It's been a fairly entertaining time. How do you think things will change? But I do want to eventually, like, get through Our Mass Effect, so I feel like I should wrap this up Females first. Help shape the future. Otherwise, I'm going to wind up not doing it. Before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. <laughs> <sighs> Most seem hell bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they've become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. How'd you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. I found Malon's lab. It looked like a dungeon. His experiments were brutal. We learned that too late. He meant well, but his methods grew more barbaric as he went. We finally escaped into the rubble. Eventually, a Salarian team found us. They saved our lives. We were so sick. Would you go to Malon again? Absolutely. <laughs> Would you recommend them? One candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I'm glad to see humans treat their women with respect. Your people have placed a lot of responsibility on you. No more than your people have put on you. <laughs> then maybe we can show the men how it's done. Deal. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. Oh, hold on. Commander, what do you have to say? blood tests are in good order. Malin's notes have been invaluable in restoring her health. I'm glad I saved them. You quite possibly saved her life, too. How have you been getting along with Eve? She tried to kill me at first. Krogan don't react well to Solarians doing medical tests on them. Once that was cleared up, We've formed something of a cross-species relational bond. You mean you're friends now? It's more an agreement not to kill each other. Species take time to evolve. So do friendships. Though I still haven't learned <clears throat> her real name yet. Have you? She said it's a secret. Baffling custom. I suppose Eve will have to do for now. Though one wonders how other Krogan would get her attention. Excuse me, Krogan of female persuasion. Do you have a moment? <laughs> Jesus. How is this cure gonna work? I'm hoping it will inspire a resurgence in Krogan sex. I've always wondered how they made it. Jesus! Don't imagine it that vividly! Not what I meant. No, but you were probably thinking it. And now's our chance. In the interest of science, how do what? Krogan mate? Very clumsily. And there we have it. Could be worth writing paper someday. <laughs> now, as to your question, we can extract the DNA that renders immunity from her tissue to produce a viable mutagen. In turn, this mutagen will alter the gland function across the whole Krogan species. Large and presumably irritable infants will soon follow. He is a weirdo. What the fuck? <laughs> Anyone ever tell you you're a bit odd? It's the odd ones, the mutations, who move life forward. <clears throat> they expand the possibilities. On that, Morden, Solace, and I agreed. Morden could be Just, pretty unusual, what the fuck? too. A side effect of our work. It often decides the fate of millions, even billions of lives. No mind is immune to the pressure. We all fracture in different ways. <clears throat> Morden's conscience haunted him. Malin crossed the line into barbaric experiments. And myself, I went searching for whatever gods created the rules for this unfortunate universe. Hmm. I know an STG scientist named Morden Solis. Have you heard of him? Indeed. I once punched him in the face. <laughs> you what? He was still an STG at the time. I postulated there was more to evolution than just random mutation. Morden disagreed. 
We argued, we drank, then argued some more. Soon enough, a good fracas seemed the best way to settle things. Who won? He got a black eye. I broke a few fingers. We called it even and went back to drinking. So the two of you were friends? Some weeks, yes. Some weeks we didn't speak to each other. There were tremendous stresses for those involved in Genophage research. My side of it was all theoretical. His side... Well, he went to Tachanka. He saw its effects up close. He was never the same after that. I now understand. I'm sorry to say, Morden died. I know. STG is aware of your mission through the Omega-4 relay. For Morden's sake, I hope he finally found the grace he deserved. And new music. If I hear <sighs> Gilbert and Sullivan one more time, it's astonishing what noise some species consider harmonious. I'm Thanks. sad he died. I appreciate your help in this. And I appreciate the chance to witness this moment in history, Commander. We're charting a new course in evolution. It was such bullshit. He should have lived. Yeah, fucking... Secret combat score assigned to every character. Building the crucible, although I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard? Hmm. Lucky you keep its location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you will do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. <laughs> My lips are sealed. Nope. A Prothean. A living, breathing Prothean right below me. Yeah. Not what I expected. Me neither. He was a little cold when I tried to talk. I understand the shock of waking up again. His species gone. But a Prothean Shepherd. There's so much he could tell us. Hello again. Hi. Hello again. Hello. Hello again. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'll I'll read those another time. That's a lot. My brain is currently not not really a a reader brain. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Do I get to have the cool pistol that he had? No. How about here? Still not. Shame that. Mm. No, 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 no. We need to save up. We want the fucking Widowmaker. The... Wait, not the Widowmaker. Just... Just Widow. No Maker attached. Widowmaker here. Alright, let's see. Uh... Oh ho! A new system has been revealed. <laughs> Wait, what? I guess this must not be new after all. I'm just a fool. Oh boy, I'm not. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, mostly this is for da, 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 da. mostly full this is full this is full bah, 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 bah. we've got them uh let's go to the Petra nebula let's see let's see what's there this bitch also empty Oh, this is where Grissom was. God dang it. Alright, let's, let's just do a fucking mission. Whatever. <laughs> I think we've done just about all the exploring. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, ho, ho, we're about to meet Grunt. Fuck yes. Uh, 
All right, let's see. This mission is going to be a little bit hell, if I remember correctly. Like, just ever so slightly trash fire mission. Stressful, difficult. Damn, that's language. Holy shit. Aggie, what did you say? What the fuck? Um, who do we want? Mm, I mean, Garrus is a given. Guns? What does gunt mean? <laughs> ah, big sneeze. Let's see, force, impact. Let's go by force. Any updates, Shepard? <clears throat> Our backup's waiting for us at the drop point. Arlac Company, Krogan Commandos. That's correct, Shepard. They are an accomplished unit. Their decisive action in liberating a colony from Batarian pirates made them famous. Good to hear. Other than that, there's been no word from a team of Krogan scouts since they went through the Rachni relay. Understandable. In my cycle, we use the Rachni as living weapons. Weapons? They were only animals then, without technology. Violent, but useful. When they became a problem, we burned 200 worlds to stop them. We don't know much, but no Rachni activity has been reported. It doesn't make sense. We let that last Rachni queen live on the condition she disappear forever. She wouldn't risk everything to start a war. Just be ready for anything. Yeah, surely there's no, like, third yeah, factor here just arrived. You better that get could possibly be influencing See things. Anything, let me know. A grunt? Shepard? <laughs> Shepard! <laughs> hey, son. What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Didn't those idiots lock you up? They did. Put me in lockdown to keep the Batarians off me. Didn't want problems with the Council while they prepared for war. But the situation changed. Yeah, they got bigger problems, all right. That's why I'm out here running Arlac Company. They're tough, think they're invincible. Reckless, but effective. Sounds familiar, Grunt. How'd you go from being new and unproven to your own command? It wasn't easy. When Rex put Arlac Company together, he needed a leader who represented the future of our species. Thanks to you, I completed my rite of passage on Tachanka and became part of Clan Erdnot. I was an equal. And being the strongest, I was chosen to lead this honored company. I bet some didn't like a tank bread Krogan being in charge. I collected a few scars earning my place here. These Krogan respect me. You were a pain in the ass, Grunt. But if your Krogan are half the soldier you are, we might make it out of here. Hey, <laughs> glad you're here to crack some heads, Shepard. Hard to believe this might be Rachni. Seems crazy. The Rachni. Chance to face the old enemy? <laughs> Impossible to resist. Yes, you are the one. The Krogan who occupied my quarters on the Normandy left your mark. What? Who is this, Shepard? You shouldn't <laughs> be so anxious to face the Rachni. They were formidable opponents, even to my people. Ask me later. <sighs> Whatever you say. We don't know if the Rachni had anything to do with this. We're here to find the scouts. I didn't see any signs of activity during our approach. Agreed. But this place smells wrong. Like a bad wound. 
Our scans show the tunnels down there lead to a large central point. If we're lucky, it's a nest. Sounds like fun. Just like old times, Grunt. <laughs> I like the crunch in his voice. Move out! Grab what you need, Shepard. Meet me at the scout camp ahead. Sounds good. Take what you need and move out. Hell yeah. Let's fucking steal some shit. Whatever's not laying to... It's a claymore. Oh, it's a shotgun, right? Whatever's not nailed down, we're gonna take it. Cause we're never coming back to this place. Their base camp has been decimated. The Krogan are overconfident. It's their weakness. Uh huh. Tactical schmovement. for these piercing Oof. oh jeez stability ultralight no 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 yes damage give me that I think so too I feel like Shepard would fit right into Elden Ring Look at those fucking rolls she's got. Ready, Shepard. We're right behind you. So you are. You ready to go? What did you do after the collectors were defeated? I spent most of my time back on Tachanka learning what it was to be Krogan. In the lab where I was created, the lessons were like fighting with practice weapons. They had no bite, no impact. <laughs> I needed the blood and pain. I made mistakes, but I learned. Tell me more about this company. Arlak means Eye of Wrath. We are named after the fierce Tichanka son. Rex handpicked us from different clans to show a united Krogan. We were sent because we're the strongest. Did Warlord Okir imprint anything on you about the Rachni during your creation? Okir ensured I knew of the Rachni. They are respected as an enemy. Everyone thought they were dead, defeated by the Krogan. You proved that wrong. If they're here, my blood demands they die. What happened to the scouting party? Looks like something dropped half their camp down a hole. Their shuttle must have been lost as well. They weren't going anywhere. Doesn't matter. We're here to find the Rachni and burn them out. All right, let's get going. Hell yeah. Finally, right behind you, Shepard. Time for some fucking action. Some schmovement. Gotta be tactical about it. Woohoo! Oh jeez! Oh. That actually startled me. <laughs> Everyone alright? Shepard! You in one piece! Looks like we're all okay! Keep in radio contact! On our way! Shepherd in one piece? What kind of devil fruit does she got? <laughs> Ahead of us. I see it. Grunt, got a body of a scout here. Been dead a few days. Yeah, if he has his weapon, grab it. You won't need it anymore. Is that webbing? Looks like it. This reminds me a little bit of like uh, Ocarina of Time with the the, the big tree this at the start. Is going to make it a little the harsh. deco tree. Agreed. Everybody, be ready. Be ready. Move Whoa! On. Anybody catch that? Confirm. Careful. We need to be cautious. They're dangerous. Because that place also had a lot of those web walls in it. And you also had to burn them. I bet this 
is directly inspired by it. What do you mean, dead end? <coughs> Big schneeze. Confirmed. Modified and very dangerous. Finally, something to kill. Nothing here yet. Lost a Krogan to a sinkhole. Bad way to go. The breeding ground must be here. The Reapers are protecting an asset of great significance. I kind of don't want to waste too much flamethrower ammo on these things. Like... like half a reaper on its own what is that is that the barrier generator i think it must be god dang it Ooh. not that i wield shotguns and a new flamethrower Okay, so walking past is not really uh, an option. Not anymore. It's the world's largest tiger. Hello. It is also currently a dog. Looks like we're finding another way out of here. Come on. Ours? What the fuck? What do you mean you have a Twitch account? Kevin. I didn't even know you 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 did Twitch ever. That hurts my feelings, Grant. Yeah, yeah. World's biggest puppy. Did you know ours is like six feet tall? Local man in the fucking stratosphere. Oh shit! You watch way too much Twitch, but you don't got time for me in your schedule. I see how it is. <laughs> Hurt my feelings here. Died making sure we could make it to the central chamber. Come on. Oh 
Oh my god, you're six foot three. I'm gonna troll my hair about that for like the next coming week until I forget. <laughs> Ooh, you're six foot three. How's the weather up there? Oh my god. Well, now you know. I'm a streamer and I'm here on like 6 p.m. on what was it? Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. 6 p.m. Eastern. I think you're a California tiger. <laughs> I didn't see that one coming. Come on, there's gonna be like another flamethrower soon, right? Looks like a last message. He's asked that it be delivered to an Asari named Araba on the Citadel. Nothing here. Yeah, what are you swearing? A large area, Commander. Expect trouble. A large area? Thanks for the heads up, I didn't see it. How the fuck does Javik just... I thought he's supposed to be like a big soldier boy. How do you keep dying like this? Fucking perish. Oh. oh, Jesus. Stop shooting me. I mean, Pepper. That's gonna hit me. Uh, bah, 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 bah. All right, we got the big boy out of the way. Fucking finally. No, you fucking don't. Oh, I hate the Rachni. I mean, I like the, the original ones. They're nice, but these ones, the, the modified ones, fuck them. Wah, 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 wah. Stay low. Don't let it get a beat on you. Oh god. Right back at you. Wop. You know what? Fucking who needs who needs a flamethrower in this kind of situation? This situation calls for explosive sniper rifle and biotics. Hey man, um, that's the button. There we go. Let's see. Wah, 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 wah. Yeah, no, honestly, the flamethrowers are kind of not as good as what I actually just brought. I know, right? 
If I didn't go wah 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 wah, how would you know what sound it makes? Like, wah, 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 wah. Must be getting close, Shepard. Some heavy fighting. Tough bastards. Casualties? It's fine. Wah, 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 wah. I just fucking love how it sounds though, like just wah, 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 wah. You know how it is. Wah, 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 wah. Ah, that didn't work. I'm gonna say no to the firestorm. But yes to the grenades! Well, those didn't go anywhere. Uh, I meant to go Renegade, but I wind up doing Paragon anyway, because I'm too nice. I just can't fucking help myself. I bet they're breathing an army down here. Breathing like flies. And this place is well hidden. I mean, it adds up. I agree. I tried so hard to be mean in Mass Effect 2 and it just, it wouldn't, it wouldn't stick. I wound up with Paragon anyway. Ah, it's all eggs! <laughs> But yeah, I've, I've kind of given up on uh, on going Renegade. I'm gonna have to stay. Oh, okay. I mean, I could have also been High Renegade to get Tali and Legion, uh, Legion to get along. Ow. There we go. I didn't have to be. I could have been. I could have gone. Thanks, just mean that evil. Webbing stopping us. That was Reaper Tech. <clears throat> we ran into it too. The Rachni have backed off for now. But they can smell our wounds. Any worthy enemy would regroup and finish us. Soon. We're close, Grunt. Those barriers were protecting whatever's down that passage. We'll dig in here, kill anything that moves. Buy you some time. Good luck. I don't need luck. I have ammo. Krogan, get ready! Well, aren't you lucky? Ours, if you look at my YouTube, which is the same as this, you can watch me play the whole thing. I got Mass Effect 1, I got Mass Effect 2, and now I'm playing Mass Effect 3. Ugh. All on YouTube slash Wolfulian. My entire adventure. Grunt, we've located the central chamber. Good. We got your back, Shepard. <sighs> Move it! Damn it! 
If I was her, I would have just fucking American Ninja warrior the whole thing. Just just fucking puck word over it. Hmm. Oh! Oh, okay. Well, if that's all. Wah, 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 wah. Bop. And a beep. See, with sufficient cover, these are actually not an issue. Shepard, over here. But they never actually spawn in areas that have sufficient cover, so this is like a rare treat. Yay! No, you fucking don't! They keep trying to eat their allies. Their fallen allies, I might add. It's like, mm mm, don't mind if I do. Shout out to Biotics being fucking target seeking. Can you imagine if I had to aim this shit? I wouldn't do nothing. I wouldn't succeed at fuck all. followed by somebody shout out to person I cannot look right now <laughs> sorry I'll, I'll honor you in a moment Bop. oh my god <laughs> tigers are ambush predators just in case that wasn't clear a little explosion on them. Shout out to ours. Hold on, I got I gotta do it like a real fish streamer. I gotta like adjust my glass and be like shout out to um zero six zero zero hours for following <laughs> Oh God. What the? My friend and latest follower, O six hundred. did this to you? Yes. The sour note of the machines is 
I let you go back on Novaria. You promised not to interfere anymore. The Rachni were supposed to disappear. We remember. We kept our promise. Retreated back through the relay. We started a new home. Beautiful children. In harmony. What if I shortened it to 06? <laughs> Can you still feel the Reapers? Can they influence you? We hear the machines, but they cannot control us. Remove this last shackle, and we are free. The children return. They will destroy us all. Really fast. It's just zero. Copy that, Grud. Are you capable of fighting the Reapers? We hate the machines. <laughs> we will fight for our unborn children. Really fast. Yeah, seems legit. She needs too much time to escape. Is that clear? Listen Sorry, up. man. Our lab company holds the Rathne off while the Queen escapes. We'll buy you some time. Grunt, fall back to our position and lead us out. Damn you, Shepard! I'm leaving my team. On my way. Commander? That's an order. She's too valuable an asset to lose. <laughs> Wait, no, that's not. There's no God Save the Queen in this one. That's the American <laughs> anthem. Get us out of here. I actually don't fucking know the, the, the English national song. And frankly, I shouldn't. What the fuck? Why would I want that? I think my favorite part about the Krogan is the little nubby tail they got. It's just three of them. I'll hold them off. No. Get out of here, Shepard. Stay alive, you big dumb baby. My turn. <laughs> Why would you not just move along with us? Also, I want that shotgun. No! Man, what the fuck? Cortez, we're the last ones out. Copy that, Commander. Shuttle is waiting. Oh, there he is. Never mind. We're Gucci. Grunt! Anybody got something to eat? Uh. I'm reviewing a report on the Rachni situation, Commander. 
This could have gotten complicated fast. I hope you know what you're doing, cutting a deal with the Rectai Queen. We got burned last time. No, we fucking I'm didn't. Trusting your instincts, Commander. We can count on her support, Admiral. She stuck to her I deal in so. the Reaper's Carter. But we cut the Reaper supply of new Rachni troops and picked up some additional Krogan support. I call that a victory. I've got to get back to it, Commander. Watch yourself out there. Hack it out. Hack it out. Hack it in. Hack it out. Shepard, Hack it, made it out of there. Sounds like I missed a hell of a fight. It was bloody, Rex. We could have used you. Too busy talking rather than fighting. Feeling restless. A war going on and I'm stuck keeping the peace. I heard you made some kind of deal with the Rachni Queen. If they get out of hand again, it's your ass on the line. Understood. I heard Grunt managed to get out of there with a few scratches. You can <laughs> say that. We'll get it patched up. Back in the fight. Good to hear. I should get back to it. Keep me posted, Shepard. Hell yeah. A resounding succeeds. Commander. I've verified the initial test results. Eve's cells are accepting the male Krogan tissue. Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure's ready? Not quite. Now we need a carrier, a method for inserting the cure into the genetic structure of other Krogan. You infected them with the disease easy enough. Is the cure that different? No, it isn't. Which may work to our advantage. Hmm. There is a facility on Tachanka. It might suit our purposes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The Shroud. My government built it during the Krogan uplift after their nuclear war. What does it do? The tower disperses atmospheric particles to protect the planet from solar radiation. But it had another use as well. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. Those were desperate times. But it can save the Krogan now. The original genophage strain is in storage at the Shroud facility. It can serve as the carrier for the cure, and the Shroud can disperse it across Tachanka. You clever little pie jack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Wix. Certainly. I'll be in the med bay with Eve if you need me. Yay! Admiral Anderson is available on Bitcoin. Admiral Anderson? Well, we can't keep him waiting, can we? Shepard, so I imagine by now you've wiped the galaxy clean of Reapers and we can all come up for air? Not quite. There have been a few complications. Aren't there always? Hackett filled me in on the crucible. Sounds like you've got some knots to untangle. <laughs> nuts. I'm just glad I could take care of one of them for you. I got a you and Kaylee Sanders were close. I owe you for that one, Shepard. <laughs> I'm Kaylee sorry. And I, met almost 20 years I only ago. have the one brain cell. We even had a run-in with Saren in his early days. She and I were more than close. Ooh, Anderson's got a smooch friend. And if the world has a way of reminding you what you forgot to do, maybe when the war's over, Kaylee and I will do something about that. You'll see her soon. I can hope. But you've got a bigger problem right now. Like a galaxy full of scared bureaucrats. It's what you hired me to do. Mostly you were hired to kill Reapers. I hope you haven't been sidetracked by all the politics. Nothing I can't handle. What about you? What's happening on Earth? I am on shrimping. I am on shrimping. Thank you for the boss to check. <laughs> that bad? You and I knew what we were in for. But everyone else? <laughs> I don't think the shock's worn off yet. Are you safe? That changes by the hour. I caught a shuttle evac out of Vancouver. And now we're running from Foxhole to Foxhole just trying to stay alive. What about the Reapers? They're harvesting everything that moves. They're focusing on the big cities, which does give us some room to maneuver. You think you can hang on? Hell, we're still just trying to talk to each other. Right now, all we can do is organize the resistance at a local level. No lack of volunteers, at least. Everybody knows what's at stake. I don't know how we'll win this yet, but we will. Even if it kills me. Well, you've already died once, and that didn't slow you down. But let's not tempt fate. Keep yourself safe, Shepard. You too, sir. 
We'll talk again soon. Anderson out. They're like, well, we hired you to kill Reapers, but they forgot that we just barely managed to kill one. Like, very, very barely. And now there's like a whole fleet. Ah, oh, but look at us go. We're almost at the minimum strength required. Hey, man. You got anything new to say? No. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. <clears throat> yeah. Something wrong? Hello, Sammy. That's Solarian Wicks. He got his tissue sample from me, all right. Let's just say scalpels were never meant to cut where he cut. Maybe. I can't believe he took one of his balls. One of his four Krogan balls. Whoop. Don't be a dick. That's a great plan. Follow war with more war. Yeah, listen to the other girl. Commander, Cerberus is attacking civilians on Benning. We've been asked to help evacuate the planet. There was something else she told nice me. To see you again. How are you settling in, trainer? I actually feel somewhat useful. It's been challenging to integrate data feeds for the war summit. How are the systems holding? Well, I'm glad we performed stress tests. Specialist trainer has been extremely helpful. The accuracy of our war room data is a direct result of her work. Thank you, Edie. I'm still getting used to all of this. In the lab, we hoard everything, piles of tech everywhere. Out here, it's like living out of a shoebox. Life on an active ship always feels crowded at first. You'll get used to it. Oh. It's not a bad thing. I've got no problems getting cozy. <laughs> this is wonderful. Back in the lab, we had to hoard because we had no budget. Now, Edie, Ariaki Tech uses a proprietary smart processing algorithm that could clean up our long range data. Can we license it? We can. Analyzing and applying the upgrade now. The algorithm should reduce long range strategic combat data analysis time by 3%. Hot oh, dang, 3%. If it means getting the equipment I need, I can quite happily live out of the shoebox. So, like, did you know they had that and just held back on getting it to show off in front of me, or...? <laughs> Krogan and the Trias really should get behind Ooh. the Alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. Shepard, I had a question about human behavior. Uh huh. Why is it you never have questions about Asari behavior or Turian behavior? I tried asking Liara questions about the Asari bonding process. She said I do not guard the secrets of the Normandy's crew carefully enough for her to entrust me with such private information. The Asari <laughs> word she used translates as blabbermouth. I think she has become a more private person since becoming the Shadow Broker. Tell me about it. Hello, Shepard. How's Grunt? Our little tank baby's all grown up, huh? Yeah. Apparently, he'll be on his feet and killing again. Little, little no baby. Well, you, you enjoying your wet food? Every time he incinerates someone with a shotgun and does that little laugh, he'll think of you. Edie says it was Rachni down there? Yeah. I thought they were on our side after you saved the queen on Novaria. It wasn't her fault. She got captured. She's with us now. Until the next time the Reapers sing a sour yellow note of whatever. Don't be a bitch. It's not like we've never been indoctrinated. Fucking, it, it happens to everybody. I don't know why people are angry at the at the rack knife for having it happen to them. <clears throat> Sam. My cat is like the cutest. Like just in case that was ever in doubt. I have like possibly the best cat. He's got such fluffy little cheeks. Sammy, Zero loves you. 
<laughs> He's looking at me about it. <laughs> My good friend Zero. Alright, I don't think there's anything to be gotten in this fucking system. Jump I can catch it just now. It was on me. Evasion Technically, you're supposed to get a game over screen if one of them catches up with you, but I guess not. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. We got we got Cerberus seductions. What's this? Ooh, this is what's left of Arct Arcturus Station. This is where like the the last line of human defense was and all I that. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. fuel. We've got fuel. Ho oh, oh, ho, oui, wee oui. wee. Mon amour, mon ami. Well, that's not it. Come on. Ah, oh, fuck off. Alright, Cerberus abductions it is. Fortunately, it resets every time there's like a... Every time we do a mission. Sam? Little baby. Alright, we got Garrus, and Javik is fucking useless. I'm gonna take Liara again. Yeah, no, the weapons are fine. If implants are so healing, how about it? I know. What the fuck? I'm aware. see uh health and armor damage armor penetration Ooh. don't mind me mm. damage per second yes why not hello sammy what you looking at me for? Hmm? Little baby. Yeah. You're such a sweet little baby, 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 kitty cat. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're so sweet. For what purpose? Since you're caught in their crosshairs. Exactly. Secure the area so we can establish a rescue lifeline to the rest of the city. Approaching the drop point, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. The people down there are counting on you, Commander. Hack it out. Hack it in. Hack it out. Building an avalanche of civilian SOS requests, Commander. The bulk are concentrated on the upper street. Way. Keep me updated. Oh, digging deeper just to throw it away. I hack it out, digging deeper just to throw it away. <laughs> Action! Wait, who just shot that civilian? Where are you? Um, zap that. And uh, maybe I should fortify and also maybe retreat. Oh god, I'm not as cool as I thought I was. 
And uh, kill them all. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Ah, come on! Hey man, what the fuck? This is my cover. You can't be here. <laughs> I loaded this gun with special 90 degree bullets. Okay, and where else? There's someone just like still screaming. Just having a bit of a time up there. You good? Oh! Pop, pop. What is going on up there? Who's like giving birth? Is that. Are you shitting me? Is that the guy we got like with the with the throw earlier? Eh. Come on. Where are you? How am I gonna get up there? Is there a way? He's just gonna be screaming indefinitely, huh? Um. Hmm. Well, the thing is, the mission is not progressing unless I kill him, right? Like... Did that do it? How about this? Alright, we have grenades! What? Yeah! There we go! What is it, Lieutenant? I'm tracking civilians fleeing the city with Cerberus troops right behind. Where are they? Updating your nav. Point, you can intercept them there. We must hurry. <clears throat> I don't want to die. That's okay, you won't. <laughs> Yeah, no, they, they just... They sort of... Turtle? Like, you hit them with an ability that ragdolls them, and then they just... Sort of lay there, screaming. Try to stay calm. What? What should we do? Just stay down. Commander, more service troops are heading your way. If you can hold the line there... Or give the civilians time to escape. We we hold here. Hey man. Ah, the telltale sound of someone already, like, laying there again. You hear him, right? He's just like, Whoa, huh, huh, huh. <laughs> Like, man! Calm yourself, you'll be fine. Oh, actually, no, never mind. <laughs> I am coming to kill you. Very much still happening. Hey, man. Bop. Of 
course you can. I love the double tap. There were spare parts here somewhere. Oh, there they are. Bop! You good? Let's see. Man, these guys are fucking losers. Huh? Oh, again, huh? Sorry, man. Damn, that was kind of grim, honestly. <laughs> Need to use this ladder. Oh, that was not my intention, and now I'm in a bad spot. Forget they both have like team wide. I'm I'm a fool. How many more am I gonna have to kill? Like geez, it's easily been like two dozen, right? lucky damn Boop. we're getting reports of continuing strikes against other cities on Benning Cerberus still denying responsibility? Yes, and for once we're inclined to believe them gunning down innocent humans isn't their usual MO. Either way, the civilians down there have a chance now. We're solidifying the foothold and getting people out, then we'll move to liberating the rest of the planet. I hope we can say the same for Earth. One day, Commander. For now, we've got our work cut out for us. Carry on. Yay! And the time I spend on this is time I didn't spend on forging a Turian Krogan alliance. Yay. It just straight up wasn't anybody else who could have done this. That's an idea. Hello, Sammy. What's up? You're speaking with me. Chatting me up a little bit. What's up? 
Hmm? You going What do you want? Little baby. Mm-hmm. Ooh, Intel. Hi. Oh dear. <laughs> All right, everybody, it's time for a group haul. Oh! <laughs> Normally, there's supposed to be uh, a little video playing, but it broke, and I haven't quite figured out how to fix it yet. I don't know what happened there. I have, like, a little GIF that normally plays where there's, like, a bunch of wolves on the screen, and they howl together, and I don't have to howl on my own. <laughs> Apologies for not for not for not being as good as it could have been. Boop. Hello Sammy. Hello Sammy. Little baby. Yeah. Doc 42. Are you brave? Uh, the great commander Shepard. <laughs> that meeting without my autograph book. Hell yes. Just take me to Aria. Follow me. So where is she? In a golden car. Aria, how dramatic. There are too many eyes and ears in purgatory. I assume this is about retaking Omega. This is about your war, Shepard. Cerberus controlling the Terminus system seriously bolsters their mobility. Since taking Omega, they've spread through the galaxy. Surely the Alliance has noticed. Cut to the chase. What's your plan? Kick them out. I've amassed a fleet of Merc ships. We're going to punch through enemy lines and invade. Once we're on Omega, it's a ground war. That's why I want you. I only accept the best. The best. The leader of the Cerberus occupation is General Oleg Petrovsky. He's the one who ousted me. Don't know him. The elusive man's top military strategist and best kept secret. But all you really need to know is that he's a merciless bastard. What's your intel on the occupation? Petrovsky's army is massive and he's got Omega locked tight. The information stops there. So you're winging it? Not at all. There are secrets on Omega only I know. Secrets that will provide us a foothold. I can tell you this. Petrovsky's invasion was precise and ruthless. We'll stop at nothing to win. Sounds familiar. Shepard, I know my reputation. I know I'm hated. I ruled Omega with an iron fist. But the people were free. Their lives were theirs. I preserved that. This man took all that away and he is going to pay. Is mine again, I'll give you everything. I've got ships, mercs, Ezo, all yours for the war. What's the catch? I have objections to some of the company you keep. So Excuse you have to me? Leave the Normandy and its crew behind. My crew are professionals. Let's just say I want you all to myself. A wink. <laughs> Bray will provide coordinates to my fleet. Oh, and while we're still in the Citadel, please be discreet. The fleet is hidden in this system. Signal me when you're on your way. Ari and I will meet you on the command ship. <laughs> Can't wait to see what all the fuss is about. Then. We've been briefed. The fleet is hidden in this system. What? Like, right over there, just 
extremely well hidden. The Citadel is right here. <laughs> My fucking god. I didn't think they meant like literally this system. I thought what they meant was, you know, pointing on the Wait, map basically. Do you need ground transport? <sighs> I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. I'm not sure why. There was something important I had to do, and... Oh, are you looking for someone, ma'am? I... Oh. Maybe. I have these papers, but I'm not sure why. Here, why don't I take care of these for you? Would that help? Yes. Yes, please. You know, you remind me of someone. My son. Baby. He's dating an Asari. She looks remarkably like you do. She's so very happy. Thank you. That's wonderful, ma'am. Yep. So sad. There's this confused woman who keeps coming here looking for her son. And this is sorry who just... Kindly plays along. Hi. That's not what I wanted. There we go. Come on, Black Widow. Am I lamb? Woo! Information on Bilal! Oh my god, I didn't know that this was where I had to go. Civilian hmm. soldiers and obtaining proof of Bilal's death would ease his father's mind. The dog tag should be presented as though the spectre personally retrieved them. Okay. Let's buy some dog tags and bring them to the dead. Bringing terrible, awful, bad, sad news. It's what we do. Damn, you just like sitting here, don't you? Just like within line of sight. Keeping an eye on me, making sure I don't go away. Yeah. Yes. Have you found my son? I found your son's body in the slums on Benning. He sacrificed himself to save his squad. I uh, see. Their guilt made them avoid me. They should feel honored by his sacrifice. I. I know that I do. Thank you, my friend. You're welcome. No problem. All in a day's work. Welcome, Commander Shepard. I'm Commander Shepard, and your son is dead. <laughs> oh no. Areas tagged of interest. Let's just let's just let's just go through each floor because I remember there was something that we needed to do. Really? What'd he say? Any idea how busy he is? He said I thought about talking to him, not that I did. Billy! What are these things to shoot you? Nah, you won't. I'm the only one willing to stand here with you all day. Shut up. I've been bit. Also, I am... Sir. Um. Um? Sir, you've locked me in. Uh, um Out of the way, son. The man's stuck. Please. Please. <laughs> Help. Help. Why are you doing this? Oh my god. Um I mean, I've always wanted to be stuck between three Torians, but why are you doing what? Move on! Don't you have like a route to take? Don't you have to be walking back and forth and stuff? Uh. 
<laughs> um, I guess when was the last save? 37, and it is now 139. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's load this. Let's let's let's. It's not too far back. Where am I? Right, this was right after I gave him the dog tags. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. All right. Now that we know that a trap is coming, look, man, what what were you fucking thinking, huh? Huh? How's it feel? How's it feel? How do you like getting stuck? Where are you even going? Where is your destination? What's your NPC fucking your AI route? I like that he's just looking at me. Like, man. Why did you? Okay, okay. Where are you going now, huh? What's 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 your destination here? What's your game, man? Uh huh. All right, you're standing at that car. Man. All right. Everyone have a drink? Yeah. Raise a glass, boys. Valal Osova. Only on account of him do I still draw breath. Valal Osova, one brave son of a bitch. Here, here. Shout out to Valal Osova. <laughs> and then I want to see dancers and not just crappy pole work. Mel. Like, take the raunchiest thing you can imagine and then add a hanar hanging on somewhere. Mel. Listen, the guys are kind of weirded out by you being here. Ooh, he finally said it. Brave man. Oh, hey, Vega. Thanks for the drink. Oh, shut up. Okay, nothing new here, I don't think. Um, let's go. I know we have to visit someone at the Hopsible. There was an email that we got about it. And then I think on the Presidium... You know, I could technically just consult my journal. I should, after this. <laughs> Tell Matriarch Athena that our huntresses should have the upgrades waiting for them on their next shore leap. No, they were very easy to scare. The humans made some amazing breakthroughs. What's with NPCs just walking up to me? Stop. Good hey, girl. Worsty. Yeah. Everything all right? I guess. Oh, I took Udina's offer. Specter status. Congratulations. Seems small compared to what's going on. You ready for the responsibilities of a specter? Doesn't feel real yet. Maybe it'll sink in. I don't know what duties I'll have. Everything's a mess right now. What do you think of all this? Yeah, I'm never sure of Udina's motives. Seems a little too convenient. Well, gee, thanks for your support. I don't need Udina to tell me you're an exceptional soldier. Nor should you. I not I guess so. He said we'll have the official ceremony soon. Once I'm out of here. And after? Any plans to come back yeah. to the Normandy? Good question. I guess that's up to Udina. Sure. Let me know. You feeling better? I'm fine. Other than the pile of paperwork the doc's gonna throw at me. Sorry, I'm so distracted, Shepard. It's just... What's going on? I heard from my mom. They got out in time. They're okay. Good. That's good news. But my youngest sister, Sarah, she just learned her husband was killed in action. He was the second lieutenant stationed under Demeter. Good guy. I'm sorry, Ash. Thanks. Hey. Yeah. Sarah wasn't much for the military life. We were all surprised when they got married. This war will take its toll. Sacrifices like his give the rest of us a fighting chance. It never changes. 
does it. I wanted to protect her from all this. Yeah. What? Don't blame yourself. No, definitely never changes. I know. But I'm her big sis, you know. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody, but unbowed. What's that from? Invictus by Henley. One of my dad's savvy poets. It's about not giving up. Right. My sister wants to do a thing at the memorial. Nothing fancy. Just some words about the family. It'll be tough. Keep me posted, all right? Will do. <laughs> hey, baby. <laughs> Man, this doctor is raven. I found this metagel formula. Figured you could make good use of it. Where did you find this? Never mind, it doesn't matter. Yes, we can put this to good use. Thank you. You're welcome. I forgot where I even picked it up. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. All right, hold on, where's my journal? Yeah, but, but that's my codex. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rendezvous with her. Uh, gotta. Oh. You know, not to chunk up. Ba 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 ba. Where's the where's where's the thing about? Hmm. Eating unit stabilizers. Whatever. Where's the where's the thing about like uh? There we go. Speak to Commander Bailey in the embassies and then give the rule. Okay. And this? General Oraka. And this? Narl in the commons. Okay, whatever. I can do that. I can do that. I do believe Oraka is also in the commons, if memory serves. It's been fucking forever since I last played this game. Hmm. Oh, I'm out of money, Jesus. <laughs> the Widow was so fucking expensive. Best sniper rifle in the game, though. I don't know. A text message is so impersonal. He's off risking his life. He deserves more than that. I could record something, but I hate leaving big messages. I always get flustered. Maybe I need a script. Or maybe I need to get him on a vid call so I can do it face to face. Who knows when he'll be deployed somewhere with an open comm channel. He knew it'd be hard to communicate when he left you here. Yeah, girl, break up with your husband. Keep the tradition alive. Husband goes to war, you go and fuck someone else. Why is that such a common fucking story? Quick, get behind your back. We'll be here any minute. What the hell are you talking about? Great. Blood Pack's leader. Aria brings him the great commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. This goes wrong. It's your ass. Quiet. I have to look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this. Well, why is Shepard. one of these guys? Want you to know. Your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Creep. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Why is a watcher leading the blood what pack right now? You, Gross. What? You have my word. Now open fire. Now I yet. thought it was like a Krogan. To take over. A Krogan outfit. Yes. Yes. 
I'm Arias Moore, Shepard. You've scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Uh-huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. How do they form any kind of sentence anyway without lips? Like, it's all sharp teeth. Don't mind me, I'm Commander Shepard and I'm a nosy fucking bitch. Just sticking it into everybody's business. Hey man. Commander Shepard. General Araka. I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable if I recall. Yes. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now. But he won't sell his top-line arms. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Alright. Let me guess, I have to do the fucking... the terminal. Where do we go? What, what do we got? Du, 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 du. Aria, 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 the Blue Suns. Find a way to deal with. Oh my god, it's not even telling me what to do. Ugh. I guess I'll have to use my brain. Wah. Oh, I know about Oraka. Don't, don't fucking mark him again. Hurrah. Hey, girl. I have noticed many displays of public affection on the Citadel. The rate seems disproportionately high. Everybody could die tomorrow, Edie. Looking up is one of the few things they can do. I wonder if this is how the Krogan feel. I can't believe there's gonna be a fucking baby boom after all this. Welcome to the Galaxy wide. All proceeds from today's purchases go to the Centurion War. Like the next generation is gonna be fucking literally just boomers. But look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here and all my arms are legal, see? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with the bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. Uh-huh. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. So what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and then spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. I don't got a brain. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. 
CSEC wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple artifacts. What kind of artifacts? Do you want to be like more specific, man? Dang. Ugh. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. We appreciate your like, buddy. Oh, there's the gun. There's the the fun little grenade pistol that the guy had. Thank you for shopping at Agor Munitions. But it's out of our price range because we're dirt poor after buying a very fancy sniper rifle. Huh. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's not spying on me now? Ah, uh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. <laughs> oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. It'd be smart to bury the threats, Sedaris. I'll toss them into the caskets with my victims. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Sane, my second in command, is a weak-willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. All right. Maybe Thanks for the lead. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Thanks for introducing me to your second in command by name. He's like, oh, you gotta deal with me, unless you were to convince the other guy. See, if the guy were smart, he would just leave me to rot. But he would never. Surely there's nobody particularly charismatic out there who could convince him. <laughs> oh, okay. Goodbye, hours. I'll see you probably next time, maybe, perhaps. Who knows? Goodbye. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Arriving at docking bay E twenty four. Emergency civilian housing. Okay, if memory serves. The guy I want is somewhere here in this containers area. Oh You should visit. Hey man. I, I was on my boat when boom the sky went black. Uh-huh. Dust and ash. Uh-huh. A giant metal wall rushed down. I fell into the river. Ever stop talking? When I climbed out, I heard screaming. The metal wall started to move, and I realized it was a leg. Only one of the Reaper's legs. I hope they become friends eventually. Are you? No, you're just a, just a creature. Ba 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 ba. Nope. Where is the man I need? Not here. Aha! We just got a report that another ship made it off the Alliance. Hey, man. Men, get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. <coughs> Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. Hmm. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Hmm. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Easy. And just like that, the woman's gonna fucking rot. Shepard, the council withdrew the release order. 
Hell yes. Arya Talok of all people got him to do it. Crazy. You can say that again. Thanks for your help, Shepard. You're welcome. All in a day's Please work. Of sorts. <laughs> oh, hiccups. Jeez. One moment. Okay, now, what else do we got? Aria, 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 the blue sun's right. I want to check my little, um, my little special spectre terminal. See if maybe that'll, uh, that'll have the relics for the guy. If not, I guess maybe I'll stumble across them just, like, flying around the galaxy. No, you're not the guy. That's the right door. Nope. Nope. Okay, so that wasn't it. I guess I'll find it just like while exploring, huh? He wants cool relics. Of an unspecified nature. Not gonna fucking tell me what he wants. Oh! My son. He's a soldier, you know. I know. Please, Teresa, are you sure you don't remember me? Calling me by my first name is very forward of you, young lady. Oh, no. I'm you didn't do that. I, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I must have confused you with someone else. Oh, oh no. Worries. no. Now, perhaps you can help. I'm looking for my son. He's a soldier. Been gone for a long while. Ah, uh, she's she's the son's girlfriend. Oh no! Oh, that's oh, that's her mother-in-law, and she's confused and hasn't she can't recognize her anymore. No. Oh, my heart. I thought she was just a very polite, like, worker, just sort of, sort of dealing with it, just, you know, being nice to the poor confused woman, but, oh god, it's so much worse. Oh, my heart. Oh. Oh, boy. All right, let's do one more mission. Let's see if we can't knock one more out, and then we'll probably uh, have to call it. Da, 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 da. Not, not Arya's special DLC mission, though. I'm not feeling like doing that one. But uh, let's let's go into the DMZ. Let's see. Anything cool in the Tuchanka system? No. I guess that's reasonable. Any cool other systems? Yes! Always gotta do your exploration before you do a mission. Oh dear, that's a big sun. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's something. God damn it. Ugh. Faster than light jump success. And back in. And we yoink that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Fuel. And we get back out. Oh Jesus. Oh God. Oh fuck. Oh God. Oh fuck. Oh God. Oh fuck. Oh. oh. Successful. Just some fuel. Nothing. Whew. Whee. Got like three separate missions here. Um. 
Let's, uh, let's save the Turian survivors. Let's, let's leave the big genophage curing for next time. Uh, gotta have Geras and Liawa. I'm shrimp myself a bit. Oh, yes. Do we have light? Yeah, there we go. Piercing mod. Mm. Thermal clip. Let's let's go with the scope for now. Let's see uh, how that holds up. God, I love this thing so much. We're gonna need a couple upgrades to that later on, just to make it like lighter. This crash site's a nightmare. Edie, try to raise Lieutenant Victus. Yes, ma'am. For a Turian commander, what happened here is... Let's just say the Turian code is not forgiving. And that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. Is that the best you can do? Yes, ma'am. The Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. All right, we're here. Edie, did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. The immediate reaction. He was ready. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying. This sounds bad. Let's move. Looks worse than I feared. I'm here to a secret Turian mission on Tachanka is especially odd. Ah damn, they keep fucking come up through any of my networks. Interrupting me. I'm here to give sass and eat ass and have all out of ass. Shh, you see them? Quick, we don't want them to call for backup. Wah, 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 wah. Like they survived the crash, but then a harvester took them out, died in the explosion, and then pulled out to be eaten by husks. I don't like that husks eat people now. They didn't used to do that. Okay, I have a visual on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Surprise on our side for once. I like it. Exactly. Let's go. Well, they're about to find out. Oh, oh it's already dead. Spare grenades. <laughs> Oh, no, this rifle. Oh boy. So there is. That harvester is going to destroy the Korean escape pod. Not if I have anything to say about it. And it's gone. Thank you. Don't stop 
Okay. Not stopping for you. Save them all. Excellent work. And a hook. Keep moving. We need to find the main crash site ASAP. Oh dear. Being the son of Adrian Victus is a lot to live up to. It's a big military name on Palavin. Wars expected to run in the Victus blood. Children shouldn't be burdened with the successes of their parents any more than their failings. Mm-hmm. Ah, but Liara, you're expecting a progressive society. These people are like a military sort of aristocracy. I know they say it's a meritocracy, but I mean, look at them. Looks like we got the jump. Follow my lead. Mm -hmm. No longer got the jump. Why are you not being scooped? Oh, that's a friendly Torian. God, look at the fucking damage, though. Oh. Your hit points are fucking forfeit. Oh, oh, it's got brained. Jeez! Oh, they explode pretty spectacularly, huh? Oh boy! All right, all right, all right. Any, any fucking am off mission? There we go. I guess that's the one big downside to this rifle, huh? You only got so many shots. Do you read, Commander? Repeat. Do you read? Shepard here. What's your status? We're in deep. Commander, what's your ETA? Hang tight. We're on our way. Do you read, Commander? Boy, how did you know? I love reading! Oh, there's a ladder. Shepard here. Understood. Oh, I think that's what it feels like to be shot by one of them, huh? I don't like that they keep flying away. It feels like I'm wasting my ammo. Like, should I even shoot at it? Oh god, I gotta be careful, huh? Not the kind of combat roll I want it. We are very, very pinned down. And I wish we were not.
I'm aware about first aid game, please. Do you even have a health bar? I guess not. Ah! Hmm. So this is not correct, huh? I thought I was supposed to advance and then like, you know, kill it. Where else? Here it goes. There is still a hostile somewhere. in like that general vicinity. Just gotta bob and weave, boys. Huh. There we go. Okay, let's pick it up. It's important we don't lose this squad. It seems that the Turians are playing with political dynamite here. Maybe they should inform the Krogan. Krogan Turian animosity is ancient and it's all right, let's move! Oh whoops. Not one more soldier died here today. For Palavin. Yeah, for Palavin. <laughs> for Cardassia. There's a brute coming! I don't like it! There we go! Imagine what it's gonna be like once it is upgraded. Like, holy shit. It's already tearing through them so fast. You know, maybe I should just. That's my other weapon. I am almost out of ammo for this. to just advance are they gonna spawn indefinitely I don't think they are right oh Let's bring Lara, Liara back into the fight. Did she just die again immediately? Ugh. Girl, why did I even resurrect you?
so far so good. We can technically keep this up, but... Good reminder though, thanks for the uh, mini grenades. Let's see. Whoop! When in doubt, just fucking chonk him. Whoop! Just, you know, grenades. Whoop! Oh, it knows we're here. Okay, never mind. That's a little scary. Can we, like, gain a little faster ground, please? Oh. Um. Oh, he got spaghettified. Are you like almost ready to die? Come on. Okay, not really the intended way for this to go. Oop. Can we shoot you? Oh, there was a hit marker for that. Hold on. Oh ho! Look at that—the little, the little cross around the around the target. Come on, explode already! Perish. There we fucking go. Ugh. Over here. I wonder if I could have just killed the last one already, technically. Whew. Lieutenant Victus? I'm not smart. Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. You're welcome, pitched up Garrus. He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant, what's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And my men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Owning your mistake takes guts, but you have to get over it and move on. Of course. It's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, oh my if fucking Cerberus god. That bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it, and so did you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? What's wrong with you? Inspire them, threaten them, Lieutenant. If Cerberus succeeds, the Reapers divide and conquer us, and then that is on them. There we go. Listen up. This isn't about your fears and grievances. Fears? 
We're only afraid of the next messed up order you give. Irrelevant. Court martial death and dishonor awaits anyone who walks at his duty. We are Turing. We finish what we came here to do, or we die trying. Shuttles arrive any minute, so get your asses in gear. Let's move! Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, you have a second chance here. Make their sacrifice count. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. Honestly surprised to hear Turian, like, be this whiny about having suffered a loss. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Celtic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. Krogan Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Hack it out. Primarch Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that... Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. What do you mean? I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Yeah. Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? It doesn't make sense. The end times are upon us, man. Way heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. You know what I mean? <laughs> sure. And? And? And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. Saving your son so far. He's going right back in there with me. And then he may die. We'll see about that. Wouldn't wouldn't count my chickens just yet. Wouldn't put all my chickens in the same basket. Shoot it till it's dead. Now we go down to the shuttle bay, because we just got paid. Hey Esteban, for your shuttle being so stealthy and all, you sure do get shot at a lot. Well, the UT-47A stealth systems only internalize heat and high band emissions. So while few sensors can pick us up, our cover is blown as soon as someone looks up. Time for an upgrade. Most scanners and tracking systems don't operate in mid-range frequencies. Sure, maybe we've been shot at, but we haven't been shot down. Yet. Lucky for us, you're almost as good a pilot as you think you are. Well, uh huh, yeah. uh huh. There's that too. Now, the Black Widow. Damage, ammo, and weight. Yes. And then we go right back in. Because I said I was gonna finish this mission, and I didn't realize it was a two-parter. <laughs> you know what? Why don't we take James for a walk? Come on. You know, James, walkies. There we go. Much better already. Um, James. Where's the Claymore? There we go. Accuracy. Damage. Shredder. 
and then damage. My man don't got powers. So he doesn't really have to worry about uh, weight. Take the mattock. Uh, damage, of course. The nice thing about AI is the precision is perfect, so like, whatever. They don't, they don't need fucking... They don't need scopes. Yeah, James is getting enrichment. We're taking him for walkies. Carnage, incendiaries, health and armor. Yes. I don't know that he even does headshots. Whatever. Ooh. Explosive. Don't mind me. We hear you, 9th Platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus <laughs> bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Brutal. But it makes a certain kind of sense. Put the Krogan down hard. Does it? You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? You already Those neutered them. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. Why did you plant a bomb? They already didn't have the numbers anymore. That was like their one big string. You didn't see me miss that shot just now. I had it all lined up and cool. Man, this really is a fucking war zone, huh? This is some fucking World War One shit. To be able to like aim through smoke with the with the with the thing I had. What's it called? The scope. That's the word I was looking for. Moving. Get to the building. Once we reach the bomb, I'll need to reprogram the trigger mechanism. Ooh. I like that there's just upgrades scattered around this fucking war zone. Like, what are you doing? No, you fucking don't.
threading the needle. Where are those shields coming from? They have a generator somewhere, don't they? Then, there we go. No, you fucking don't. Easy. And there's the fucking generator. Over on the left, exit. I like that they guide you. Because this is we kind of a, and then plant a bomb kind of a messy area. Extreme, but those were desperate times. No, they fucking they weren't. They, had to. they didn't Maybe have to do that. Have more with us than I thought. Shut the fuck I up. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. Don't waffle on about that. That was like unilaterally a bad move. Straight up unnecessary. A little bit overkill. Good work, Lieutenant. Commander, we're getting a lot of mortar fire. Heavy casualties. Taking alternate route. Circling around the gun site. Copy that. Are you still talking? Available units contain Shepard. I love that they know me by name. I love that they fear me by name. Like, ooh, you're such a scared little fascist. Ooh. I don't like the sound of that. Oh, they're not getting it. Ooh, money. Bop. Bop. Oh, good idea, grenades. Digging did they fucking do? We won't get a second chance. We gotta move, Shepard. Commander, we're entering the bomb site. Moving towards the control station. Roger that. We're on our way. We're closing on the hard test. They'll be swarming out any minute now. Uh -huh. Agreed. Then all of the things behind me. Hi. Little baby boy. Yeah. God dang it. Hello, baby. Yeah. You're such a sweet little sausage. I love you too. Yeah. Looks like control schematics for automated turrets. No good now, but they might be useful later. Servers has the trouble on us. Such a big Attention, old chonker. Oh, those are the turrets. Yeah. Your Surfer soft little head is so pettable. To slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll You're petting shaped. But like you said. No trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Starting bypass. And 
Thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Oh, rip. Snipers. Damn it. Commander. Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Nobody gets back. <laughs> All you is that. Fuck. <laughs> I'm aware. Ooh, a missile launcher. I bet that's gonna come in handy later when they inevitably drop another mech on us. Actually, I don't. I don't need fucking. Let me. Let me. Let me take that. Oh. Oh. Okay. Never mind. Bah. Ah, oh, come on! Right back at you! You go. Take that thing down. Uh, down. why? Why did it fucking get deployed right on top of us? Now where's the rocket? I had it. Was it here? No. Was it here? There it is. All right, buddy. Whoop. Oh, it's that kind of okay. Eh, good enough. Mm-hmm. Commander, firewall's down. I'm in. Spirits. Cerberus hacked the trigger mechanism. It's a Spirits! Disarm it! No time! I have to separate the trigger from the bomb. Now! Why didn't you do that to begin with? Mechanical solutions are always more foolproof. Digital is convenient, but vulnerable. I know what I'm talking about. It's doggy wisdom. I'm highly educated. Oh, yes. Why was it designed in such a way that you have to stand square in the middle of it? Look, man, don't worry about me, yeah? You you do your job. Lieutenant! Victory. At any cost. Oof. Do you think he, uh... Do you think he's alive? took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. Hey. He never hesitated. 
Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for this. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and war is expected. He did us proud, but we're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first. It's all just expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did. Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb? They moved in. Won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Heck it out. Heck out. We couldn't risk another. That's what I say to my cat whenever he eats something forbidden. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey. We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. Primark, you had a bomb on Tachanka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Shepard. It's over. His own son died today making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you make your point. We have stronger enemies to face. <laughs> I love that Rex is intimidated. I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. I do not. You could have told me and I would have kept my mouth shut. I hate secrets and politicians, Primarch. Your son had to die to fix this. Yes. You're right, Commander. It was a mistake not to trust you. I know that now. You sent me in blind, you dumbass. Didn't have to go like this. Could have been so much easier, but no. My son. He died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. You're welcome. All in a doggy day done. How far are we? Or down. Alright, let's position ourselves. Let's make sure we're in the right spot. We can yell the front lines. Why have they got us guarding the door anyway? It's gonna break ranks right now. War makes people stupid. Besides, I talked with Moreau. Electra's invaded this ship to kidnap the crew. Damn. Okay, I guess we gotta be ready for anything to come through that door. Damn right. You better protect my pilot. Hey, Wanda, there's a new message at your private terminal. And I will get to it in time. Let's save here. Please do not turn off my computer. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's it for now. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. There's not really anybody streaming right now that we could be uh, raiding, but I hope you all had fun. I hope you all enjoyed yourselves, even though I was a little bit not super energetic. Ugh. Um... Yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> I'll see y'all again on Wednesday at 6 p.m. Eastern. Uh, when we continue this, we're going to probably cure the genophage that time around. Uh, thank you for showing up and goodbye.